Hi, so this last exercise for the Tricks and Games class, um, I wanted to do this outside. It's very windy and nobody could hear me. So what you're going to do, you're going to write your dog's name in chalk or tape. Um, if you have an outside area, um, we have a back patio, it's cement. So I could write Captain, he's got a long name. So this is a really great exercise uh, for us to work on loose leash walking. Now you're gonna write each letter really large. Um, so if you run out of space, if you have a really long dog name, maybe just use your abbreviated name for a bit. <laughs> if you have two dogs, maybe just write dogs, and then you can do this, um, the same exercise for both. But the idea is with a loose leash, you and your dog follow the letters exactly. So you are walking on the C of captain, then the A of captain, um, as if you are uh, doing this as a loose leash walking exercise, you can use hand signals. If you're in a fenced in area, you could do it off leash and just use hand signals. Um, but if you are doing this with um, as a loose leash exercise and you have the leash in your hand, I would also encourage you to fill a cup of water. <laughs> um, fill up a cup of water and see how much water you have left at the end time yourself, or if you have a partner, have them time you. Um, so you can do a couple of variations of it. You could practice maybe um, off-leash handling skills just to get the mechanics right. Um, you could practice on-leash so that way you're holding the leash. Remember, the leash is on the side opposite your dog. So if Captain's here, my treat bag and my dog are here and my leash is here and I'm handling him and I'm rewarding him here and the leash is loose here. Um, and then if you want to do it for time, you can time and accuracy. You can fill a cup of water and see how much water is left at the end of your, your dog's name. Um, so there are very, a lot of variations that you can do using chalk tape, some space, a leash, and your dog. Um, so why don't you guys try those? Send them to me because I want to see how they look for you. And I'm sorry I couldn't really demonstrate it. It was just too windy out um, and nobody could hear me. Um, and it was also kind of shadowy out, so the video just didn't come out. But I thought maybe I would try to explain it to you. <laughs> and after six weeks of doing tricks, most of you have been through my classes before. You know how I teach. Um, you know how this would probably look. And I would like to see how you take this exercise and make it your own. So give it a shot. Send me a video. Let me know how it looks. And I will see you guys, hopefully in person, very, very soon. Keep up the good work, guys. Bye.